don't you? Okay. I want a real one. Okay, this is a child. I'll start teaching you transportation. It shouldn't take you long to master it. Only about 10 years of dedicated study. But I want it now! Okay, next scene. Oh, it's the same scene. What's in wait for me there, I wonder? Okay, so there is clearly a child involved. Is it a tiny gnome child? It's female? Wait, 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 wait. Could we have been raised by a Rilu? Nobody has talked about our our past, our history, our, our thing. We don't know where we're from, do we? Maybe we did that in character creation and I'm just I'm just dumb. You don't take that for a twist, eh? Wherever my legs carry me. Hello? Terrain type unknown. I mean it looks like a pretty temperate forest to me, so I don't know about unknown. Okay. This is just a typical thing of me, right? Don't go the obvious way. Let's look for loot first. Oh, you can't go back here? We can. Let's just game being game. This is my XCOM gland showing, I know. What's in wait for me there? Can you blame me though? Is this gonna take me out of here? Uh, not sure that's what I wanted. Not sure that's what I wanted. I I wasn't done exploring. I wasn't done exploring. Quick save the most powerful magic spell. I know, right? It is so Imba. We have some sun summoning circlight. A seedling give it soil, space, and moisture. Nothing can grow in cramped captivity. And she's obviously nurturing this child. Oh, here we go. They would ever experiment. I mean, mom's lab messing around with regents. The circle is almost ready. I think I just need a place of vial with summoning formula here. Let's see what's happened. This is going to be fun. Okay, she is definitely human, so it's not us. I think. Unless they couldn't figure out how to use our model for this, but I don't think that's the case. Oh, god damn it! <laughs> Um, Valor friend, could we just like have a murder here? Okay. Slow down, girl. Mom, I know you're watching. You would never leave me in danger, would you? Press F, Press F to pay, to pay respects. respects. <laughs> but you let me learn things, try things. I. Oh, thank you, Mom. But one day I will sneak out without you noticing and do everything my way. Loot? Oh no, chat, we have a choice. We have a choice. Wherever my legs carry me. Chat? Which portal do we take? Before I go, yes? We have choice. So this seems like the obvious... Um, remember the while I picked up in the house? 
Oh, yeah. Summoning. Drop. Do the thing. Do what thing? Like I, I don't I don't have any any prompts for any interaction. Loot. Wait, this looks weird. Did I do it wrong? It is 30% likely to be better than the last time I flopped around with summoning circle. Oh, no. <laughs> Look. We knew what we were doing. We summoned that demon willingly and deliberately. I think if you come here, Kesto, enable launch and you can have a full attack run. Aru, uh, do the thing. Demon, you mean loot elemental? Yeah, loot elemental. Vavivka. Okay, let's uh, step closer. Loot table check times. <laughs> Do I need to mess with this nerd? I'm on a magic missile, you ass. Okay, maybe not. Um, um, Spontan, you go first. Charge this man. You cannot charge, why? <sighs> God damn it, man. <laughs> Yes, I'm also disappointed. Yeah. Oh, it's not actually dead? Oh, it has to t wait for a turn rubbish. Okay. Stunty legs. Yay. Did he get tripped? I don't know, I'll take it. Heyo! Loot table check. Trash. Absolute garbadio! Well, I mean... Forwards. No backwards, backwards. So... This seems like... If you spawned in here, you walked straight along the path, you found a thing, you found a portal, you went in the portal. This seems like the the, the happy path. I think the surprise magic door, wherever it was, is the more interesting option. Wait, where where is magic door? Is it Gonski? No, oh, here it is. So I feel like this is the one that most people are not expected to take, so I wanna see what's here. So we have a way back. Secrets can escape my prying gaze. And that's loot. Wherever my legs carry me. Okay, we have some regions. Rando assortment of spells. More scrolls. This is the lab, Shirley. Don't call me Shirley. 
Oh, wait, 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 wait. A reel of Orlash's drafts. A lorg pile of unsorted notes, drafts, and sketches of various arcane rituals. Magic researchers could potentially glean something useful from this material. Okay. Trail me. Okay, more spells. So clearly the notes are the thing we would have we wanted to find here, right? Am I still looking for plot Romina Kion? Yeah. Yeah, I was hoping I'd find the great plot twist thinning. Okay, we are back at another intersection with questions, a questions. What is to be done with vanquished foes? What is to be done with treacherous friends? I know the answers to these and to many more questions. <laughs> Fire? I know. Can we? Okay, not fire. Mm -hmm. Disappoint. Sad. Uh, not totally. Not suspicious. Meat hooks hanging from the ceiling. Absolute. Setre Devimai. Are you the child? Now dead. Locked in her thing. Oh. Interrogation record. Hold up. Hold. The prisoner was asked three questions. What was the source of her sinful power? Who taught her the craft? And what deeds was she intending to pursue by it? Having not received an answer, the interrogator called first for the use of simple means of loosening the criminal's tongue, but for the more intricate tools to be kept in clear view also for the purpose of intimidation when these measures failed to produce results dot, 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 dot. wait who's who is writing this is Aurelia the prisoner or is she writing the note Well, if Arilu is writing the note, who is the interrogator? And source of sinful power. So, demonic power, profane power? Which... And we have a her... Like, we, we have gendered the person here. Or you call it, we have sexed the person. I, I believe that is correct use of the term. Taught her the craft. So I think the prisoner was a Rilu. Denunciation. I beg you to inform the first hunter and high interrogator that the prisoner a little Verlesh, okay is covertly preparing a ritual of unthinkable scale. If she's not stopped, the consequences will be devastating. I beseech you to be prudent. Prisoner upon. So is this a prisoner like a captive or a... Like, in the same way as an engineer is a person running the engine, is this the person running the prison? The prisoner? That is the correct use of the term, but still sounds <laughs> dirty. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. It's correct. It's technically correct language. Okay, I am a hunter of threshold. Okay, so threshold is where the world wound first appeared. The best among the best. I'm the keeper of Sarkoris, its protector against the corruption and machinations, and powerful sins and poisoned. And poisoned? It's 
poisoned. Ah. Keeper of Sarkors is poisoned nerds. Okay. I feel the gaze of the ancestors and the gods upon me. I will follow the trail of any beast, be it demon, hag, witch, or rogue mage. I will root them out in any land, in any pit, in any den. Those who surrender, I will imprison. Those who resist, I will slay without hesitation. There is nothing I would not do to repel the corruption, for I am all that stands between the lands and its people and horrifying calamities. I'm a hunter of threshold. Okay. So was this hunter sent after Arilu? And who is this guy? The ghost standing before you used to be a tall man, built like a warrior, but death has twisted his features and bent his back. His eye sockets are empty his body mutilated, and his face a mask of insanity. Is this the hunter, maybe? There's a, there's a, there's a little bit of an old-school name there. Forgiveness. I beg forgiveness. Nobody else should suffer for what I've done. I had to protect the people of Sarkoris. I killed. Killed. Okay, so this is the hunter. Show him the stern hand. This is an item that we have. Who are you? Only half of our unit returned. A nasty fight. We thought the witch would be alone. It, I didn't know. I didn't know I killed. But I had no idea who I was killing. So the witch must be referring to Arilu. And I think she probably used some transmutation, some polymorph or something. And made this man kill somebody dear to him. That sounds like something a demon would do, right? And that's why he went insane and lost his marbles. Who this? Sarkor is blessed by the gods, Sarkor is, I was supposed to protect you. For you, I fought unholy sources of witches. Okay, this is definitely the hunter. And all the others who tainted the sanctity of magic. I defended you. I did what I had to do. I killed because I had to. Why? Why? What did I do wrong? What are you seeking forgiveness for? I shouldn't have taken her to threshold. I should have slain her where she stood. She didn't resist for the first few days. She didn't even understand where she was or where we were keeping her. She just kept repeating, I promise. I promise. Oh, did they capture the child? And then Mama was all upset his spaghetti and went like loco loco on their butts. Name is Setra Deviman of the Foundless Clan. I'm a witch hunter. Okay, that that agrees with our theory. I chased them. I found them. I fished them out of their holes, their hidden lairs. Broke their spells, crushed their defenses. The first, the best. I fought entire cowans by myself. I led an army of my brothers in arms to battle. But then, this death, I killed. Oh, if only I hadn't killed. Who are you talking about? She led me, walking arm in arm with me. My eyes were gone, but I could still hear the screams. She described what I could not see. Is dying light. The step. A Veska war swarm descending on the last unit, still trying to hold the line. She said, here are the cultists dancing and raising their daggers to stab their prisoners through the heart. Here is the last bastion of your clan, the Foundlass. Do you want to know what happened to them, Hunter? I didn't want to. I couldn't help but ask. Am I, am I to blame for this? Who is seeking forgiveness for? Insects chittering and squirming, eating my eyes that I can't see through them. Yes, I can, although they're no longer in my sockets. 
Okay, so he got eaten by Veskavor swarm. Do you recognize this hand? This this is my hand. How stern its grip was. Men and women knew it. Witches and sorcerers alike. It was not my hand. It was the hand of Sarkoris itself. Insane. Okay. As if awakened by your voice, the ghost raises his head and speaks in the assertive tone of someone accustomed to giving orders. I am Cetroid Devimai, the founder the found of the Foundless Clan, the first hunter of Threshold, protector of Sarkoris. I am the witch's nemesis, the best hunter of my land. I received an order to capture the witch Ariela Vorlesh, and I carried out that order. I brought her to Threshold as a prisoner. I killed the witch's accomplice. I killed her. Okay. So we have the option to tell him to let go and go face for us misjudgment. Doesn't seem like us, does it? You used to execute and imprison Sarkora mages. Now you will remain imprisoned forever. It's only just. That does seem like an evil thing to do. Not letting him get um, the eternal rest. Or we could just murderize him. Do you think he has a loot table? So like, where are we? We are in... Hold on. We must be in a subplane of Galarian. And there was a note in the library of Nocticula about some correspondence with somebody trying to create a subplane. And that somebody, we don't know who it was, but it might have been Varilu. Meaning this would be her subplane where she has conjured up everything. What will killing him do to this this plane? To Arilu. And if she made this, then this is her home. Or her hideaway, rather. And she asked us a question earlier, right? What to do with um, your vanquished foes and what to do with all of that. So she imprisoned her vanquished foe, which was this hunter, in this plane, never letting him escape or face Farasma's judgment. For eternal torment. So definitely I think one would upset Arilu if we care about that at this point. Maybe there's no reason to upset her at this point. Like keep keeping let's keep our options open. I mean if we can romance her uh, I'm I'm gonna go for it. Um, but I don't. I think that ship has sailed. Anyway, maybe it's best not to mess with things. Like honestly, it probably wouldn't be a great loot table. Let's follow her steps. 
You refuse to forgive me? The ghost hunches his shoulders, utters a woeful moan, and retreats through the stone walls of his cell. Okay. Wherever my legs carry me. I think we made the right choice. So let's see what Aurelio said earlier. Questions, questions. What is to be done with vanquished foes? What is to be done with treacherous friends? She imprisoned him in eternal torment. Which is, you know, quite a classy move, if you ask me. I mean, I could think of some, some better ways, you know. Just, you know, Forward. let them be in lava, but never die. You know, kind of, that kind of thing, just roasting eternally. Fire. Fire sounds good. Is this a trap? Trail me. This definitely seems like a trap. Um... Darren, go touch the thing. Opon. Okay, this is the prisoner on. Wait, was... Okay, so let's assume that he was a captive. He was being held in the prison together with Arilu. And he ratted on her so she asked what to be done with your enemies and treacherous friends so if he ratted on her then he's the treacherous friend who is also stuck in eternal torment as was her enemy okay thick smoke raises from the brazier before you in its curling haze, you can see a pale, haggard face with a bleeding spiral carved into its forehead. Who disturbs my restless vigil? A friend? A foe? It doesn't matter. I haven't spoken with anyone in so long. I'd be happy to hear the sound of any living voice. Sorry to disappoint. <laughs> Who are you? In life, my name was Opon. I was a talented spellcaster, one of the most powerful in the land of Sarkoris. Okay, so you were also captured by the hunter, okay? I was also the most arrogant. Mm -hmm. I believed that I could always escape from the hunters of Threshold and that my talent would never fail me. What a hollow, misguided belief. The hunters eventually caught me and locked me in this cursed prison. And I died within this wall, within its walls, okay? Now I'm here, bound to this brazier for eternity in a place that looks like a cell where I spent 10 years of my life and died. I've seen a letter of denunciation signed by you. Yes, the ghost whispers. As I informed of her, I told the guards about the ritual she was working on. I tried to prevent the inevitable, but it was too late. This ring used to belong to you, didn't it? Yes, that is my ring. It's been so long since I felt its cold embrace around my finger. Cetre Devime's wolf took it, along with a chunk of my flesh. He repaired it. I'm glad. Interesting. So you could have... You could have stayed hidden for much longer if not for your bleeding heart. Yes, people always said I was too sentimental to be a rebel. But without compassion, how would we be any different from our enemies? Or from the evil monsters we were accused of being? Yes, I was caught like a fool. 